Okay, so I am taking the lighting advice of my technical lead on this channel, like for once. I didn't want to take his advice because honestly, I thought that it might be like too dark for me to put on makeup, but it's not that bad. So I'm gonna give it a shot. Just wanted to give a little update that I am down another product as far as my project pan goes that's my image skincare ageless total retinol a cream retinol a <clears throat> and look at that just like the tiniest like bit just came out just now which i'm surprised by but this is done and um i don't even know like what to do with that little bit i guess i'll just put it on this schnoz <clears throat> my nose is like really tripping out these days a lot happening with it and i don't appreciate it so i have like four other products that i really want to get through then like this like side of my um vanity can be cleared off and then i'll just have stuff that's in um this area which are is meant to for me to like try out and review and it's like long overdue so i really want to get to it um, anyhow, I'm eating breakfast out of a plastic container because that is my life. Today, I look and feel like crap, but it's okay because it's like a, not even a half day for me. Like, I'm working less than half day. So, I didn't put a lot of effort into my outfit. I didn't put a lot of effort into, well, I'm not going to put a lot of effort into my makeup. I am just going to do a little something. Oh no! What happened? Oh no, this is so bad. <sighs> I just dropped like some cream eyeshadow on the floor, which means I'm going to probably step on it. Like I don't know where it is. The little dollop. I'm going to step on it and I'm going to get cream eyeshadow on my like beautiful rug. I'm fucking irritated by like this is what I'm talking about there's like always a fucking thing dude always something I'm using the same um, mischief what is this mischief minx palette that I've been using like all week <sighs> let's see what look I can make out of this I have like some pink and some gray green and black little pops of yellow you know I don't even know I don't think I'm gonna put a lot of effort into thinking about this I'm just gonna like dig in now this is not a tutorial because i'm not like really gonna show you like what i'm doing instead i'm just gonna like slam this stuff like on my eyelid hella violently and um try to get out of here i'm being very reckless right now which is like basically every day Except for other days, I just don't take as much time while I'm being reckless because I like, always hurt myself or like drop something or break something. And like, I can't even blame it on anything besides me just being hella reckless. It's so annoying. Like, ugh. Like, why is, why is everything so annoying? Okay, I'm gonna take like a lighter color, but in like a different shade, and I'm gonna like put it up here. I never use like. This first shade, this is like my second shade. I've never used the first shade um, in this way before. So it's like, oh, it's quite orange, the two together. I don't have any orange on, so that's like not gonna work. It's very summertime, like pulling out my yellow undertones. And um, <clears throat> it's just like not appropriate for like fall vibes, if you know what I mean. So I'm gonna take some burgundy color which is like my fave and I'm gonna like see if I can pinken this up a little it's just too orange and that's like working out okay and I'm just like going on the like outer vertical half of my eye try to bring it in a little bit like on my lower lid I can never tell if like things are even it's like I don't know and if you know, it's like, why are you looking so hard? You know, like, what are you doing? Okay, now we are going to hit up these eyebrows real quick because I got to go, boo. I got to go. Well, I'm also testing out a different situation. My iPhone is mic'd up. 
and I forget if it's coidal or omnidirectional, but it's one of those two, obviously. And um, <clears throat> I am like mic'd. My mic is like just down there. And I don't know if it's picking up my audio very well because I haven't had time to play any of this stuff back. Hopefully it's the audio is decent because I'm not trying to scream in here. Like I have like people who like are in rooms next to me that I'm not trying to disturb. Ugh. These eyebrows are real hurt this morning. Like it's really bad. Carried away. This Wednesday, the Wausau Center Mall opens with a burst of excitement. Hey guys, I want to tell you about my newest video on my review channel, Pursuit of Brilliance. I post new videos once a week on Saturdays. Don't forget, write it down. We try a lot of cool things, which I can't wait to share with you. First things first, make sure you subscribe to this channel, ring the bell for notifications, and pop on over to Pursuit of Brilliance. And then rinse and repeat, because you know that's what we do. Catch you on the flip side. Bye! My washing machine is like losing it this morning. I'm like washing some pillows and um, it does not like that. I guess I put too much soap, which I didn't think I did. Like, you know, I want my stuff to be clean. And it's like a brand new, like expensive washer. Like it should be able to handle it. And I didn't overfill it. Like I put what the machine said for the load size. I adjusted how much water because and the spin situation because I didn't want the machine to like break <sighs> these eyebrows are like the worst every day they're different like I can never make them like the same every day they're different mm. something's crunchy in a really inappropriate way in like the food that I just ate stresses me out. It's like, what did I just eat, you know? And is it gonna kill me? Like, Russia is out here doing things. And obviously I'm like a very important person. Ooh, Syria too. Hella people are in this world are like doing things. North Korea. I'm very important, so. <clears throat> I just don't want people to like come for my life by putting like poison in the form of salt or sugar into the things that I consume because I always put salt and sugar which I need to not but it's so good you know it's like really hard to not do that okay I made them a little more even surprisingly I don't know how I did that but now I'm going to spoolie add some hairlines into these bitches and take off some of the excess product and then we are going to <clears throat> take our brush oh that's the wrong black oh what am i doing oh i was about to like just mess up my whole existence let's do this <sighs> i wish somebody would have told me to not fuck up my eyebrows when i was a little my eyebrows were like not the best but they looked good like I was gonna say gooder they look better than this they were like hella shaped people thought like I waxed my eyebrows and I was like no girl that's just natural but the shape was kind of dumb it's just the underneath was like clean so it's like ooh. but the like top part was stupid not like Raven Simone stupid but like just that's not like a, a fleek ass eyebrow kind of stupid so I had to fuck them up and I had no need to oh if I could do it all over again there's so many mistakes that I would not embark upon and I would just live this like perfect life of ignorance because I know people say like oh never regret your mistakes they're what help you they're they're what has made you who you are today or some shit <clears throat> and it's like no dude <sighs> I mean, I'm not ashamed of who I am today, but at the same time, it's not like who I am today is exactly who I want to be or who I wanted to be as a kid. So there's definitely things that I wish I didn't do because those things have left me like, you know, honestly broken in some ways. So why would I be like, oh yeah, glorify that? No, 
mistakes are just that mistakes and yes I've learned from them but for sure I wish I had eyebrows right now I do regret that and I think it's dumb if you like don't regret fucking up your eyebrows <laughs> it doesn't make any sense that you would like assume that like oh that's help me who be who I am today or whatever it's like help me like be like stupid looking with no makeup on <gasps> Anyways, I'm not trying to go in. Like, just because you don't have eyebrows doesn't mean you're stupid looking. I'm talking about myself, obviously. So, um, and that's what this is. This channel's about me. And my makeup disappointments. Oh, I'm taking too long. This was not meant to be this kind of day. I need to, like, hurry up. I don't know why I'm trying so hard because literally nobody's gonna come see me no one ever comes sees me at work and I'm like kind of cool with that because in the past people would be checking for me like you know they had to ask me questions and find out about stuff and it's like oh now nobody really asked me for anything and that's not what this like I mean I have stuff to do that impacts others but like nobody comes to talk to me thus far and I kind of think no one is going to come talk to me in general I'm like so good with that I like, don't want to ever be spoken to again at work I mean that's not true that's like a weird thing to say because then it would feel really weird I want people to talk to me just like only when I want them to talk to me though about what I want them to talk to me about you know like I want to like control the whole situation okay well this is I think all that I'm gonna do um <clears throat> shadow wise so I'm gonna go ahead and curl these lashes I gotta be at work in like, I think like 30 minutes. And I still, and I'm almost done with my makeup, so that, ugh, that's really good. But ow, that really hurt. I just pinched my eyelid because every day. These things are like torture devices, I swear. I honestly think that you could get a lot of like spy secrets out of somebody if you like just pinch their fucking eyelids with this. Ugh, it hurts. It's like so bad. I hate it. But I have like no eyelashes, so I have to. <clears throat> I need to hurry up and eat this food too. It's getting cold. I got some go, honey. What am I trying to do? Mm. Oh my god, I just like forgot twice in a row like what I was <laughs> doing. Mm. It's gonna fall off onto me. I used to never wear mascara because it does my eyelashes do bother my glasses but also I used to never wear um no eyeliner Anyways, um, I was telling a story. <laughs> oh, I used to never wear, I used to never not wear. Yeah, I used to never not wear eyeliner because my eyes are not good. It makes me look like sick and upset when I don't have visible lashes with liner and that's because I have a lot of bags and stuff under my eyes I've always had those ever since I was like a kid <clears throat> it's not good <sighs> but um now I've not been doing it and honestly I feel liberated I mean I still do a little bit like when I need to but a lot of times in a given week I don't anymore and it saves me time stress money and I like the look now I actually do really like the look I'm on to my last situation which is I just concealed and now I'm going to extra whatever, pat this down with some powder and set it and forget it. Ooh, 
I just feel like that was so 90s. You know, I'm gonna put glasses on so no one's gonna see. And I'm rushing and also I really care very minimally. I don't know what's wrong with my nose these days. Oh, this drawer came out. Oh, went in, went in so easy today. <clears throat> it's a blessing. Okay, let me eat this food. I'm leaving out a different direction than I normally leave out of when it comes to exiting my house, going through my garage. I'm like only okay with this angle because I have a scarf on, so you can't see my like double chin. I think that's where I left off when I um, last was talking, but I'm not 100% sure because I was interrupted, rudely interrupted by, that was a car backfire. It did scare me though. <laughs> I'm laughing at myself. Oh my god. I was rudely interrupted by people who have to live their lives in the same house as me. It's like always a thing. It's like always a thing. Here we go. I have exactly 15 minutes to get to work and keep up with... Oh, we fall. You know, I put you in a place you're not supposed to be. I have to redo my, um, my seat situation, my key fob. Uh, driver one setting because it always puts my seat back. Please don't let anyone be walking in front of me. <sighs> anyway, so I had to move my seat back into the position that I had it in yesterday when I was doing this. What is all that noise? All right, so I have on stupid clothes that don't really match very well and earrings that don't do anything for like what I'm trying to do visually. I just needed something in my ear. So, I succeeded there. <sighs> okay, so, this like makeup routine that I went through this morning was exceptionally like unimpressive and also very short. So I'm doing like extra mm, car vlog. And I don't know if these are like get readies with me or if they are just vlog situations. I don't really understand the definitions on YouTube, but, um, Cause it's like, you didn't really watch me get that ready. You know, like I was already dressed. My hair is not something that can be changed. It was just put on some makeup and I put on the minimal to not look dead. One of the things I would like to do though, is I'm hoping that with a real interest and effort in taking care of my skin, um, that I can, Fork, some of the signs of aging. <laughs> I like that word for But also, um, my makeup routine won't have to be so cumbersome, you know, because uh, if your skin is right, then you have less you have to correct for. Although, I mean, honestly, like I'm hella old, so I shouldn't have waited this long to like get serious. And it's not to say that I like waited this long to get serious, like for like the last five years, I've been really working on my acne, which was horrible. Okay, I need to get over immediately. Every day, I like take too long to get over. And it's because I used to take a different commute. So I'm not used to like really not being in these lanes. I don't know if these are get ready with me or vlog, but I'm just sitting down, doing my makeup, talking, and jamming out the door. And uh, that's what I'm doing. But hopefully with better skin through improved quality of product and effort, um, my face will be slightly better of a canvas for me to perform my artistry. Uh, I'm not an artist when it comes to this. I don't even consider myself an artist when it comes to other things. I can do a lot of things like slightly better than good or maybe just good but I'm not great at anything. 
So I really have struggle calling myself an artist because in some ways I lack some passion, but also I never like pursue something to be so good that like I feel um, like it fills me up, you know? I do want to learn to do my makeup hella good. Um, just like it's a challenge that I want to fucking like do. I hate how people don't like mind their business. Maybe I'm FaceTiming. Maybe I'm selfie videoing. Either way, this is 2018, like you shouldn't be like surprised. Just move along. I was gonna show you some birds eating trash like you've never seen that before. It was just funny to me. So anyways, never mind. Bye.